everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video i have another halloween tutorial for you guys so this is my glittery zipper look it is really easy on the wallet and super easy to do so before we get started in the tutorial if you are not already subscribed please go ahead and hit that big red button before you go um you can also follow me on instagram snapchat and twitter and i'll have those all linked down below so if you guys want to see how i created this then just keep watching Ooh, hello <laughs> so close okay um so this is the zipper i have now i got this from walmart it was in a kit um just the zipper fx kit so i wasn't going to spend crazy amount of money on something crazy for this uh but i am not going to be doing a vampire i'm gonna actually i'm gonna save those teeth for another look that'll be really cool um, so we are going to be doing, of course, the glitter zipper. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to attach the, uh, I'm going to attach the zipper. Um, and I don't, I don't really want to use a spirit gum because it's so late and I know that's like really hard to get off, even though I have remover. So I'm going to try it with some lash glue and I'm going to see how that works. All right, so the first thing I need to do is figure out exactly where I want it placed, and then we're gonna kind of mark it. <laughs> okay, so I kind of like it. Right there. All right, quick side note, go ahead and do your eye look first and then apply your zipper. It makes this process a whole lot easier. However, I decided to do it the opposite. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put lash glue on the top of the zipper and then we're going to place it on the forehead and then from there we can mark where we want the rest of it to go. Now I'm just letting it dry and I'm taking a makeup wipe and I'm just wiping the outer part of the zipper. Now starting the eye look, I'm going to be applying the Urban Decay Primer Potion. Using the Desert Dust Eyeshadow Palette, I'm going to start with the shade Eden, and I'm going to put that high above the crease. Now I'm going to take the shade Amethyst and we're going to do the same exact thing, but I'm going to bring it a little bit lower than our first shade.
going back into the shade Eden, I'm going to blend that out. Taking my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the shade Purple Velvet, I'm going to put that all over my lid. Taking the shade Twilight, I'm just going to pop that on my lid with my finger. I'm going to take a little bit more of that amethyst shade and we're going to blend. I did step away and do my brows real fast because that takes forever. Now we're going to go back into the shade Eden with a liner brush and we're going to put that on our lower lash line. Taking the shade Amethyst and putting that on our lower lash line as well. I'm going to keep it closer to my waterline. Going back in with a little bit of Eden, and we're going to blend those together. I'm just going to be applying Tarte's Lights Camera Lashes Eyeliner. Now I'm just taking my Milani Stay Put Waterproof Eyeliner and putting that in my waterline. I'm just going to be applying some of my Tarte Exposed Blush. Because this whole theme is purple, I'm going to be taking the Becca Amethyst Highlighter and we're going to put that on our cheeks and I'm going to use this as the brow bone highlight. Now I'm going to be taking my Too Faced Glitter Glue. I'm going to be placing this all inside of my zipper.
Now for the very last step, I'm gonna be applying the glitter. I'm going to be using the NYX Face and Body Glitter. And it's in the color Violet. guys so that is it for the completed look I hope you enjoy the way this turned out I think it's so pretty and it was really really easy to do so if you guys did like this video please give it a big old thumbs up for me and I'll see you next time bye